Efficient liquid cooling is key for the stable operation of modern, high-performance equipment. This is made possible by two main types of mold manufacturing processes. The first type is extrusion molds, which are used to produce the cooling tubes in a liquid cooling system. These tubes act as channels for the coolant to circulate. During production, the mold uses a precise combination of an inner part, male dye, and an outer part, female dye, to shape heated aluminum. This creates continuous tubing with specific internal channels. Besides the cooling tubes formed by the extrusion process, there is another mainstream liquid cooling component, the cooling plate. This requires the second type of mold, stamping molds. This process uses custom molds to press and shape sheet metal. Based on factors like production volume, budget, and delivery time, there are two types of stamping molds. Soft molds, suitable for samples or small batch production, and more durable, hard molds, designed for mass production. In summary, the extrusion process prepares the tubes, and the stamping process forms the plates. The two methods complement each other, with each having its own strengths in different scenarios. Together, they provide stable and efficient hardware support for liquid cooling systems, 